shit bang it. We gon' keep adding up, that's, that's the plan. Money. Smoke and pressure, that's that super sand. Yeah. He said he want smoke, nigga, what he saying? Put my body all torn like the hookah lounge. My brother got me fighting with the hookah now. Baby, now I glide 22 and rugas now. My dummy real stupid now. God, from a very young age, I've always, well, puberty young age, I've always had like pretty good skin, you know? Maybe a little breakout, a little bump or something, but it hasn't ever been too bad. And after I had my baby, it got really bad and it's really just it's just hormonal acne for real for real it's not there's not any issue like now when i get my cycle as we all do um i get breakouts and they're they're a lot more bigger than they used to be because they used to be little small ones but you know that's okay i'm gonna show you guys my updated skincare routine after i had my baby what my dermatologist recommended for me to do because before i was just kind of winging it and whatever i was doing it was working so after i had my baby my skin was like it was going through like like really bad like i'll i'll, I'll insert a picture but it was it was it was going through and it was making me feel really insecure because you know I don't know. I, maybe all people get an insecure feeling after they have a baby. Maybe, maybe it's everybody. Maybe it's just like regular people. Not so I don't know. Either way, this is what my dermatologist, my dermatologist recommended me to start using now because my face was getting so bad, and I was using um, Murad and castor oil, and my face would get greased. I would clean it. It would be dry. Then I would put the castor oil, castor oil on it, and it would get like super greasy and. You know, it just was kind of like, it wasn't really working. It was like, whatever worked before, it's not working now. You're going to have to find something else. So my dermatologist was like, you know, use this. And she was like, whatever system you use, she recommended this one. So this is what I got, the clean and clear. But she was like, whatever system you use, you need to use the whole system. Like, you see how I got, you got the cleanser, you got the spot treatment. This helps with the breakouts. And you got the, with the oil-free moisturizer and then you got the toner or the astringent or whatever you want to call it and I'm going to be using my little brush because I don't want to um do it with my hands so my dermatologist was like well the castor oil is too thick for your skin the murad is drying your skin out so you know let's try something else so I got this whole little set for like I think maybe like $13 at Walmart all of these three came together in the set all these three and then i ended up getting the spot treatment on my own because i was using it and i was like my face still has these bumps on it and my sister was like you need to use um she, she was like you need to use the spot treatment and in addition to everything that i have because this this oil free moisturizer it doesn't do enough so i have vitamin e oil as well i had to go find it because <laughs> there's a lot that happened before i started this video so you want your vitamin E oil and whoops your vitamin E oil and this is for people that have like really dry skin I'm sure this I'm sure the moisturizer alone will help you like you don't have to be like well I need the, the vitamin E oil I just needed it because I was doing the routine and my skin kept drying out which made it even worse I my face had a whole dry patch on it I mean I don't have no pictures because I was like but my face from the time that I gave birth I'm like four months out um it has cleared up really like really really good I keep looking over there because there's a mirror behind but it's cleared up like really good I mean you still got your bumps and stuff like that but it's not even close it's like half as bad as it was like I don't have a whole lot of pictures I think I just have one picture and the picture is a screenshot from a video I was trying to make but here we are y'all we're gonna start it off washing your hands because you want to make sure that your hands are clean before you go diving into your face and um i don't have water right here i did but um it fell <laughs> like the whole basin fell and luckily it was like right in front of the bat in front of the um trash can on top so when it fell it fell in the trash all the water's in the trash that's not bad that's good but i'm just saying yeah i was i was going through so we're gonna start off after you you know wet your brush up just a little pump a little goes a long way what i say dab a ranch you just want to dab you just want to dab a ranch 
and some people moisturize some people actually wet that's a moisturize wet their face before they um start i'm just gonna go straight into it I'm oh. trying to get in the crevices and in between because you never know. You like, you see that? I think, you know, I'm not a dermatologist, but I'm a person with common sense. Like real life common sense. You know what I mean? I'm a person with common sense. And, um,. I'm pretty sure when it foams. Sorry, I'm so focused and fixated on getting done. I forgot. I didn't know what's going on. No, but um, I'm sure this foam right here that I have on my face is real good. I'm sure it's really vital. I think that's really good. It's gonna get my eye. It's good. Okay, I'm just gonna keep going. In in between. I said that, and that's what I mean. So you don't want to just, you know, be regular and just, you know, oh, look at my face. You want to get that net, too. You want to get that net because, you know, it gets a little dirty. We can't help the fact that our necks get sweaty and dirty. Not all of us. We can't help that fact. But what we can help is the fact that we really should, like, wash that. You know, just wash your neck. Put a little bit of oil on it. It's not going to hurt anybody. You know what I mean? Everything I'm using in this video, I bought from Walmart. Every single thing. From this to all the way down to the vitamin E oil. Everything I got from Walmart. Because I was on a budget. After, I still am on a budget. Very much so. But I'm just saying. Like, after I gave birth, I really, you know. Starting from the bottom. Can't like that. But that time, I just so happened to have enough money. Ooh. To get this spot, to get this um kit, and not only that, get the spot treatment. Cause I really wanted to make sure that my skin like came back, you know. Like, if I could do something to help that, I will. I should probably start working out too, so I can, so my body can slim back down. But we're taking it one day at a time. All right, so my face is all washed and things like that, and um. Yeah, I can't open my eyes because I think that, like, you know, the stuff is going to get in there. I'm going to go rinse my face off with some warm water. I'm going to pat it dry. See, normally I like to use, um, this isn't a bra, this is a shirt. Um, I like to use, what is it, a white washcloth because I really like to see the progress, you know, the, the, the stuff. In addition to me, you know. After I get the studs on my face, I go and wet the brush so we can get more of like, you know, that shebang, that hoo you know. Woo, it's in my eye. Oh, gosh. Don't yell. Don't yell. Baby's going to cry. Oh, gosh. It's okay. Everything's okay. I can do this with one eye. I can do it with my eyes closed. Okay. Now I'm going to go rinse my face off with some warm water. I'm not naked. Let everything out. My white washcloths, but I do have a white towel here. So after it's all rinsed off and things like that, you want to make sure you pat that thing down, okay? You don't want to go and wipe your face like you're a dish towel or anything like that because you want to make sure you're gentle on your skin. <laughs> Alright, so face is all washed. Eyebrows. They, they all right. I think the best they could be. They good enough. I had a little, I had a little, uh, mustache. So I had to, um, shave it off. After you wash your face and you dry it in and all the good stuff, you're going to use your toner, your astringent. This stuff helps. It helps you from getting like it helps any dark marks that you might have you see how i got this on the middle of my forehead this was a bump and i oh it burns that's how you know it's work when it burns um i forgot this was a really big mark. i've had this um mark here for a really long time so i'm gonna have to use my toner to get rid of it that's why washing your face every day and using your toner like that's good like every time you wash your face you want to use that toner and if you wash your face regularly, then it should, you know, should do its job. So, you know, gotta get in my ears, you know what I'm saying? It's a really small area now. So. 
All right, my baby is called like a whole month. So we got to I'm just kidding. Um, spot free or spot treatment, not spot free, spot treatment that you want to use. And you just want to take it and use it on um all your little flare ups and breakouts and things like that. Sorry, we're right behind y'all. I have a little something on my chin. I think my friend is about to come visit me this month. I don't think. I know she's about to. I just don't know which day. But <laughs> let's set the record straight. <laughs> nah, but um, she'll be here sometime soon. So I think that's why my face is like, you know, breaking out and all that stuff down here. And I'm getting a little bumps. Ooh, you know that this stuff is working because mm, it burns. It boils. Now, I know they have other spot treatments with clean and clear but you definitely want to make sure you use this one get this one get this one this exact one they have different type of spot treatments but this is the one you want to get to get that skin you know get that skin real good and real clean all right so after my spot all right so after my spot treatment you want to moisturize so you got your spot your um why do i keep saying spot free um, you have your oil-free moisturizer and you want to get vitamin E oil. I don't know. This is how I do it. I'm telling you how you would do it if, you, if you're following this, this regimen. But um, if you don't follow it or if you don't want to follow it, this is what I do. A little bit of that. See? Put the oil on there, the vitamin E and the spot treatment. You just mix it together. Well, rub it in together. And whenever you roll on your face, you want to make sure that you get every crevice. Bless you. Oh, I wish I had one of those um those stone rollers to roll on my face. That would be nice. But yes, y'all, I done talked y'all to death and everything. And my skin is done. I mean, it's a it's a long way from where I started off. So everything's all good and i hope that whoever has skin issues maybe this could be a help for you but don't forget to like comment and subscribe this video share it you know what i mean a little something this is my this is my mob skin care routine so we're just you know we're trying to get back into life into the real reality that i made my own Hopefully I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye.